The rising crime, drug use, and homelessness are one of the busiest places in Denver. Union Station, rampant crime and homelessness have taken over one of the Mile High City's crown jewels. It has gotten so bad, one security guard working there says it's just not safe for the public. Thanks for joining us at 6 o'clock. I'm Dominic Garcia. And I'm Karen Lee. Union Station is not only a hub for transportation and travel, it's the heart of Denver. CBS4 investigator Brian Moss has been putting the pieces together, joins us now live tonight with what he's found. Brian? Karen, at night, particularly during this holiday season, Union Station just looks lovely. But the reality is it has some of the highest crime rates in this neighborhood that you can find anywhere in the city. And you really don't have to walk far from where I'm standing right here to see it firsthand. Is he breathing? Yeah, he's breathing. The bus terminal under Union Station has become a de facto homeless shelter, as we saw firsthand. This man seeming to ask me if I had drugs to share. The floor is littered with men and women sleeping and passed out. Unfortunately, it's, it's, it's not a very safe situation for patients. And Matt Fleming knows. He's worked private security here for two years. It's not conducive for regular paying customers to be down here and to try and use the service and rely on RTD as a mode of transportation. And it really sucks. Every night in the terminal and out on the plazas where commuters hustle by, Fleming says dozens of people use and sell drugs. And it's being taken over, and it's frustrating. He said an hour before this conversation, he and others revived a drug user who had overdosed. He says there are constant brawls and dangers to commuters. If you want to stay safe, I would stay away from the restroom. I would go exactly where you're going and don't make too much eye contact with people. I would definitely take the stairs instead of the elevator. Do you know how ridiculous this all sounds? I absolutely do, so I do. Denver crime stats show the Union Station neighborhood consistently ranking second for crime in Denver now. In just the last month, dozens of arrests for armed assaults, drugs, and thefts. Some of those lurking here not happy at what we were documenting. Get away from him. Stop. Go on. He's with the news. He's trying to draw attention to the things that are going on down here. Get out. And this man. Furious at what we were revealing. What? Want me to hit you? No. Want me to hit you? Stop so recording. I'm gonna hit you, all right? No, put it down because I'm gonna hit you. In a statement provided to CBS4, RTD said they are aware of what's happening and that they are enhancing security measures in response to what we're finding. And they said that they will significantly bolster security here at Union Station. However, they did not provide a timeline for when that would be happening. Coming up at 10 o'clock, we'll be hearing from passengers who use Union Station and what they're saying about all this, and also from an RTD union official who says what's happening here is simply unsafe. Reporting live in Denver, I'm Brian Moss, covering Colorado first. Brian, thank you. As you reported, Union Station is the second worst place in the city for crime behind the Central Business District downtown. Capitol Hill is third worst.